Hey guys, and this is Service the Pwn with part 13 of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge Let's Play. Alright, and when we left off, we had just caught our Minum, who is level 8 right now, and um, we're going to go ahead and try to train him up a bit before uh, anything spectacular happens to him, because Minum, in my, in my opinion, Minum sucks. But uh, I'm going to try to make him not suck. So, let's go ahead. Oh wait, that's right. I just remembered that this is in in fact the bike town and then I can go ahead and get a bike from this guy just by talking to him because you know I just tell him that I come from far away and he just gives me a bike you know so that's cool I really wish that that happened in real life because I would be from California anyway um so there's my mock bike and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, uh, register it under my registry of registration and uh, go ahead and yeah, so now I get to move super duper fast, and I need to watch out, or hold on, I'm going to go ahead and switch out my uh, blue Pikachu to the front, and actually, I'm not going to go this, oh wait, no, but there's trainers on that route, uh, I'm not, or I have to go this way, but I know that there are Blazikens in this grass that they can just mess me up, um, I, I don't even want to risk it with my blue Pikachu, so I'm just going to go ahead and overpower every Pokemon that I see with um, this, uh, my Jirachi. So, oh, also, uh, if my voice sounds kind of messed up, sorry about that. Uh, I'm sick right now. Also, if the audio on my, um, on my video sounds a little funky, something like it has an equalizer on it or something, uh, I don't really know what's up with that. I'm looking into how to fix it. But, uh, yeah, so that must be my mic messing up. But um, anyway, so there's my blue Pikachu getting to a level 9, and I'm just going to train it up until it has um, maybe some sort of electric move. Hopefully I can do that without too much trouble. Alright, quick attacks is good. Um, Alright, so going to, yeah, there we go. I like it when you can run through. Bunches and bunches of stuff without even battling anything. Mudkip. Alright, let's see if I can do anything. Mudkip is uh, water ground, I think. Um, you know what? Never mind. I'm still going to go ahead and switch out, because I don't want my Pokemon dead. So, <sighs> alright. I'm going to go ahead and Psychic the Mudkip to death, and uh, I think I just exploded its brains. That's what I, that's what I imagine when, when you Psychic something. And it dies or faints. I just I just feel like its brains just exploded. But uh, you know that's me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and heal up my Pokemon before I start out on my grinding adventure for XP and whatnot. Um, let's see if there's any people that I haven't fought around here. I don't think there is. I think I went and fought everybody. Yeah. Uh, what does this guy with the Zigzagoon want? Um. Oh, dude, I totally forgot that some Pokemon have the ability pick up. Man, that'd be pretty cool to uh, have. <laughs> Alright, um, anyway, so I'm going to go to Duford and train on some sort of something somewhere around here since I already beat the gym here. Uh, I know that the gym in the third place is Watson and, uh, let's see, oh, cool, level 8, perfect. All right, so I know that the um the gyms where I the gym where I am in whatever city that is I don't know what city it is is uh it is um Watson and he's of course electric type and uh he's got really powerful Pokemon I looked it up and his most powerful Pokemon I think is a level 23 um Magneton and yeah I'm pretty sure it'll just wreck all of my Pokemon, so I'm not even going to try it with that, but I will level up my blue Pikachu and uh, go ahead and get some nice little XP points over here, uh, and okay, this is Grimer, Grimer's going down, down to the ground, alright, uh, doesn't seem like it's doing too much for damage each. So, oh, sorry if you could hear that. That was really loud. That was my phone. Um, I'm not going to worry about that right now. However, I will go ahead and turn the volume off really quick. All right, sorry about that. 
Okay, so just in case so that my Pokemon just, I know it won't die, I'm just going to heal it frequently. And um, just just in case, because I'm sick of my Pokemon dying. I think I've had three Pokemon die already on this Nuzlocke, and it's really annoying. And I just need to be more cautious with my Pokemon. Oh, alright, the Swellow's going to fall to me. Um, hopefully, 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 hopefully. Uh, let's see, it's doing 8 damage, yeah, it's fine. Alright, and that'll give me a nice little XP bonus for, um, for it being an evolved form of Pokemon. So again, just gonna go ahead and heal up my Pokemon. Well, really, my blue Pikachu, because he's all that matters right now. And, uh, gonna go back into the cave. And, let's see what I can find. I found another Swellow. Should be pretty easy to kill. Alright, that peck kind of sucked, but um, I will kill it in two rollouts, so it's, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Alright. Wow. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and level him up real quick since he's so close. That's the Viper. I'm going to... You know what? I don't even know about the, the uh, things of what's super effective and what not against it. I haven't really looked it up, but... Yeah, I'm just gonna. I just want him to level up right now. So, um. Ooh, a Matang. That would have been pretty cool to uh, catch the first time. And it would also have been pretty cool if I had a Pokemon that knew an electric attack. But, it's okay. I think this is psychic and electric. <laughs> um, let's see if this is. Well, actually. No, it's some sort of steel. I know that. Anyway, um, alright, so, let's see what else I can find in this. Another Swallow, gonna go ahead and take it down real quick. Um, maybe not. Alright, should, okay. Uh, oh, that wasn't good, but it's okay, because I'll kill it. So, here we are again with healing up the Pokemon. Man, ten minutes really flies when you're playing this game. It's so no trouble at all to make a 10 minute video. Yeah. Alright, so. Uh, my throat hurts. Um. Again, just gonna level him up. Hey, Caterpie, Caterpie, yeah. I'm gonna kill it. Kill it. <laughs> tackle. Caterpie using tackle. That's just. That's just crazy talk. Caterpies don't know anything except string shot. All right, I don't. I'm. I'm not really afraid of this viper anymore. Uh, I think the worst it can do is wrap and lick. Yeah, because that's what I caught mine with. So, it, it'll die. Oh, but now I'm paralyzed. Um, yeah, that's not okay. And that wrap's gonna make it to where, um, I can't switch. Correct. The wrap. Yeah, can't switch. Uh, let's see. All right, I'm paralyzed, but. The lick and wrap, and I'll just go ahead and heal myself so it won't be a problem. Um, I know I have some sodi pop in here, and go ahead and heal it. Even all right, that's cool. Okay, yeah, so I'm freed from the wrap and quick attack. Gonna lick me, and I'll be paralyzed, so can't do anything. And yeah, so if I've learned anything from that, is don't mess with the Viper, because apparently it can mess you up. But um. What does Helping Hand even do? Boost the power of the recipient's moves. Ah, now it all makes sense. Okay, so it's really just a double battle move, but um, I'll go ahead and take it for Growl, because I don't really like Growl anyway. I don't really use any of the status ailment moves, but... Oh, also, um, I know that I'm not EV training or anything on this. Sorry about that if that's what you're into, but... uh. I don't I don't usually EV train or um, do any of the stat training or anything like that. But, um, yep, yeah, I think this is a pretty good time to uh, end the part. I'm just going to go ahead and go back to Slateport because the Pokemon are getting easier here. But, um, yeah, so uh, don't forget to uh, rate, comment, and subscribe. This has been Servers That Pwn with the Pokemon Let's Play, and I hope to see you guys next time.